Hello once again, audience. Um, today I'm going to talk about Netflix and possibly one of the greatest decisions I've ever made. Honestly, eight bucks a month, best eight dollars every month I could ever spend. Netflix, I came to, I didn't actually have a Netflix until I came to college and that was probably a bad decision because most of my free time that I'm not doing non-free time items like sleeping and eating and uh, what I do in my free time as a choice is completely consumed by either Pinterest or Netflix. So I guess that could be considered a con is that it is incredibly distracting. You get on and in, in, when, with your instant cue, you go back and you find TV shows that you missed or that you didn't get to watch or that, that used to be on TV and you watch four seasons straight in two days and you do nothing with your life. But the fact that you can go on and it's instant gratification and you can get any show or most shows that you're interested in is actually pretty amazing. Um, I would recommend Netflix to a lot of people, to pretty much anybody, because it's a great deal. It's The quality is fantastic. I've never had a problem with having it come through correctly. I've never had a problem with logins. And they, when you sign up, you get a free month, and then they actually contact you and make sure that you do want to continue on with it before they bill you. It's it's been a great process. They've got a great thing going for them. And I mean, who needs Blockbuster or Family Video or things like that when you can sit in your dorm room and go to Instant Queue and find some movie that you'd like to watch? Now, granted, um, another con might be that they have most shows and a lot of movies, not every single movie ever made. So you may be wanting something specific and they may not have it, but that's okay because I'm sure there's something else that you could find. And for $8 a month versus spending four or five dollars on a video to rent it for two days that doesn't make much sense um, Netflix actually has another thing going for it where they you can go online and you can order movies to be rented to your house and it's within that um, you have to order you have to pay more for it and I've never actually used that part of the site uh, just because I like instant gratification like most teenagers uh, pros would be most shows it's instant gratification, and there's several seasons of every show, so you have lots and lots to do. And then cons, I guess, would be that it takes a while for uh, newer seasons to get on Netflix. So you may be watching the first five seasons of The Office, and then you get to the end, you're like, oh my god, I have to know what happens now, and the season's not going to be there for several months. But I guess with instant gratification comes waiting. <laughs> and then... I guess the biggest con of Netflix is that it's distracting. Do your homework and then do Netflix. But I would definitely, I would definitely tell people to buy Netflix. It's a great investment and I, I use it, I definitely use my $8 worth.